Hi, you guys. Uh, this is uh, our week seven notifications. Last week, can you believe it? <laughs> it's been like the fastest and longest quarter ever. <laughs> uh, anyway, just want to let you know about things that are going to be going on this week or last week here, okay? Um, you'll still have lessons, just two though, all right? And then the last lesson is going to be an optional end of year activity, and I will explain that a little more <laughs> later on. All work then is going to be due not on Sunday, but this Friday, May 15th, okay? So late work, be sure you're emailing me about that, and you're just going to have to be really disciplined and get on top of it. Like last week, the lessons were kind of lighter. You know, this week, kind of the same two, just the two, all right? Uh, I'm not going to be available on Monday, May 11th. Uh, that is because um, I'm going to go in and clean your lockers out. So we are going to bag the stuff in your lockers, and you are going to be coming to pick it up the following Monday and Tuesday. You'll have a designated time to come pick it up, and then you're going to drop off stuff, and I'm going to talk about that in a minute. And then you'll also pick up on your book if you order that. All right, so make sure you're looking for that information to come out from Dr. Um, Wallace. All right. Now, really important that for those of you who checked out a textbook that you get that returned. Now, you should have wrote your um, name in it. And hopefully you wrote my name. If not, my name might already be in there, but make sure my name is in it as well. And for those of you who did a uh, borrowing contract for a graphing calculator, I need you to return that as well. It's going to be harder to know um, whose it is, so if you could maybe find a post-it note or a piece of tape or something and put your name on that graphing calculator, that would help me a lot, okay? Um, now, let's go back to that end of your activity. It's going to be optional. I really don't know um, what it's going to be. I don't know. It just feels like we should do something to end the year. Um, some kind of celebration, we made it. It's definitely a tough quarter, right? So I'm sending you a survey. It'll be in your uh, week's this introductory folder, right? So I need you to do the survey right off the bat so I can kind of plan ahead for what this um, end of your activity might be. So I'm gonna ask you um, to give me your opinion on some thoughts I have, and if you have some ideas, maybe you can share them with me as well. Um, one of them is like a digital scrapbook, and um, that would mean I'd kind of create a platform for you, like Google Slides or something, and everybody would contribute um, to that. So that's, that's something that will be available early on, and it's completely optional as well. But that might be something that we could do as an end of year activity is do um, a team chat, or we could do a video conference and everybody could share their page, okay? So just some thoughts there. Um, wanted to, uh, well, Thursdays when I'll make that decision, so I need to get your feedback by then, and then I'll post the details about what we'll be doing and when, and I'll probably email you about it as well, okay? All right, so let's talk just briefly about what your lessons are gonna be this week. In algebra, you're going to talk about writing quadratics given certain parameters or coordinates, for example. That's why you reviewed um, writing slope-intercept form on Friday. And then Tuesday is going to be a wrap-up of the quadratics unit, um, an activity that you may even want to get on Microsoft Teams and work with a partner on, all right? And that's really easy to do. Uh, and, you know, the directions are in there, but you can always email me if you want more directions. And again, that last lesson will be released on Wednesday, but we, I don't know when we'll do it. You know, it could be this week, could be next week, so it doesn't... Now, we don't have to have it scheduled for any specific time. There are some times that I'm not available, and you're probably not available because of those um, locker distribution things, okay? Now, Matt, that you are going to uh, do some work on volume of circular solids. So the first lesson is going to be about um, prisms and cylinders, and then the next lesson is going to be about cones and hemispheres and spheres. And again, you guys also will have an end of your activity option. It's still optional. If you're just like, oh, I'm too tired and not into it, that's fine too, okay? Just want to throw it out there and get your feedback about it, okay? All right, well, again, uh, keep me in the loop as to late work, or if you have any questions or concerns, um, I'd be more than happy to help you this week, okay? All right, hope you have a good one, and I hope to hear from you.